morning children today's subject is science today we will going to see the next part of lesson number 10 that is force and types of force in last period we started the lesson number 10 that is force and types of force in that we have seen some examples their actions okay and definition of force what is meant by force to move an object or to change the direction of an object we need to apply force then and then only that action will happen otherwise not so that is about the force <laughs> now today we are going to see the next part that is types of force so let's see there are different types of forces are there so start with one by one so the first type is muscular force see muscular force their name itself give their meaning muscular muscle means we apply the force with the help of muscles there that type of force is called the muscular force see in the picture that a man doing the lifting a weight okay so for that what he need to apply which uh, things he use muscles yes to lifting the weight he use the muscles so that is called the muscular force the movement take place with the help of bones and muscles the movements which takes place with the help of bones and muscles in the body that type of force is called the muscular force means what the force applied with the help of muscles the force applied with the help of muscles is called muscular force understood everyone muscular force with the help of bones and muscles if we apply the force that type of force is called the muscular force now use your brain power for which task in your day to day life do you use muscular force so in our day to day life for which things for which uh, actions we are using the muscular force that we have to find so many actions are there from morning till night so many things we are doing so many work we are doing for each and every things we need the muscular force for example as you are playing uh, playing on the ground so for example cricket football hockey or if you are doing exercise for that also you are using muscles yes or no so that is also muscular force only then riding a bicycle yes riding a bicycle that for that also you need to muscles then carrying the school bag as you are when you are coming to the school by walk yes uh, then when you are you are carrying a school bag so for carrying a school bag also you need the muscles then lifting a luggage while you are going out of station then you have to carry the luggage so for lifting it also you need to use some muscular force only so these are the some tasks in our day to day life so many again different examples are there that you have to find out in your day to day life for which actions you are using the muscular force understood everyone muscular force the second type is mechanical force second type is what mechanical force the name itself giving their meaning mechanical mechanical means what machines yes machineries are there means we we apply the force with the help of machines that is called the mechanical force so for doing many tasks we are using the different machines okay again muscular force is used for running some machines but some machines can run by using electricity or fuel okay or automatically it run by using the electricity or fuel so that is a machines only then again some example that is sewing machine everyone observed that sewing machine to stitch the cloth then electric pump is there washing machine is there mixer is there so these are that so many different machines are there which are used for doing many tasks so these are called the mechanical force by using machines they apply the force is applied by means of machines when we when we switch on when we on that knob of the mixer then and then only it start yes whatever may be the things we are using it get grinds 
ओके सो मीन्स वॉट द फोर्स अप्लाइड बाय मीन्स ऑफ मशीन इज कॉल्ड द मेकॅनिकल फोर्स अंडरस्टूड एव्हरी वन द सेकंड टाईप इज मेकॅनिकल फोर्स द नेम इट सेल गिव्हिंग देअर मिनिंग द फोर्स इज अप्लाइड बाय मीन्स ऑफ मशीन्स ओके दॅट इज कॉल्ड द मेकॅनिकल फोर्स द थर्ड टाईप इज अ ग्रॅव्हिटेशनल फोर्स द थर्ड टाईप इज ग्रॅव्हिटेशनल फोर्स सी इयर वन पिक्चर शोन सी द थर्ड टाईप ऑफ फोर्स इज वॉट ग्रॅव्हिटेशनल फोर्स सी इयर वन पिक्चर इज शोन दॅट बॉय थ्रोईंग अ बॉल अगेन दॅट वन ट्री इज देअर सो दॅट फ्रॉम दॅट ट्री द फ्रूट फॉलिंग डाऊन ओके सी इफ अन ऑब्जेक्ट इज थ्रोन अपवर्ड बाय अप्लाईंग फोर्स फॉर एक्झाम्पल दॅट बॉल थ्रोईंग अपवर्ड बाय अप्लाईंग फोर्स इट रीचेस अ सर्टन हाईट अँड अगेन कम्स डाऊन येस दॅट बॉल अगेन कम्स डाऊन सो वाय इज दिस सो सो वाय दिस बॉल फॉल्स डाऊन ओन मी वाय इट नॉट गो इन द स्काय अगेन वाय डू फ्रूट्स ऑन ट्री फॉल टू द ग्राउंड ओन मी ओके सो वॉट इज द रीजन बिहाइंड दॅट दॅट वी हॅव टू लर्न सी the earth pulls all the objects towards itself as we are living on the earth the earth have one type of force what uh, by what happen because of that force whatever may be the things are there objects are there the earth pulls towards itself that force is called the gravitational force gravitational force means what the force applied by the earth this force is applied by or to pull objects towards itself to pull objects towards itself is called gravitational force understood everyone so this force is applied by the earth so to pull the objects towards itself so because of the because of this force though we throw the ball upward but earth gravitational force is there so this gravitational force pull that ball towards itself towards the ground towards the earth so the balls falls down now same thing happen in fruit also now fruits when they ripe or uh, so what will happen after ripening the fruit it falls down only it not goes to the upside yes why because the earth pull that object pull that fro- fruits towards itself and because of that force the fruits falls down so that type of force is called the gravitational force understood everyone okay so the now the next part of this force again some detail study is re- there related to gravitational force that we have to see in a next video